Hi brothers and welcome to a new episode in the V12 engine theory. I will continue working on the cylinder block step by step and if you have any questions or suggestions don't hesitate to post it in the comment uh, below okay and find the description of this video and other video in the below of this video. In this course, let's work on the bellow of the cylinder block. Rotate, ro rotate your model like this and look to the view cube and fix it like this, okay? The X, Z axis, you have to see it like this. Start with this point and sketch this um, profile okay make sure the <coughs> the 3d cube view is uh, like uh, as you can see uh, in the in the picture okay add some dimension to the sketch Now go to the revolve feature and choose this like a profile, choose an axis, then press OK. Well done. We have just to fix something here. To fix this problem, you have to show the wireframe, the wireframe, okay? And in the browser, you have to show the construction, the two plans, and edit this feature, okay? This feature. Uh, you have to change, start here with from object. Sorry, you have to start from object and choose this plan. All thing is all right, price okay, and well done. You fixed the error we did in the, I think in the seventh episode or the sixth. Okay. Now uh, it's, the, it's the time to add um, uh, support to uh, to the crank shaft position okay uh, you have to select uh, this surface like uh, plan and go to sketch rotate your model like this okay and go to um, the rectangle choose center rectangle and start from here and draw this. Add some dimension to your drawing and don't forget uh, to use constraint, uh, vertical or horizontal, to fix uh, these points. Now we can use uh, push and pull and go uh, to the okay from to to this, this surface and uh, validate okay and we have uh, this result now let's select this surface and add the support horizontal support okay Let's use a rectangle, rectangle from here, okay. And another rectangle from here.
Once you finish drawing, rotate your model like this and select this area and use push and pull. Uh, you can use this arrow, okay, like this. Change here. Operation is uh, add, okay, join and make these like value well done you finish your model see ya next episode in the next episode i hope you will be in in time to see this Thanks for watching. If you like to receive more videos, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If you find this tutorial helpful, please make a thumbs up. Cheers.